Yeah. But you know, here we are, Spider Studios. We're making our own video too. For the Initiate EP. I had some of that jolt pop. You're feeling a little crazy now? Shit, fuck you up, man. Make you feel antsy? Yeah. You I anxious? Piss, man. Are you? This is the final setup of the drums and the microphones. You look pretty big now. <laughs> this is about as pro as we've ever been. <laughs> yeah, that's professional that's for you. <laughs> we never really got to hang out with Ben or go out to his place or anything like that, so knowing that he was a drummer, you know, and uh, he had an experience with drums and stuff, I was very intimidated. Hey, how long have we been playing this song? Five years? <laughs> Are you ready? Yeah. One, two, one, two, three, four. One more time just in that beginning, because you were just a little fast. Drum tracks was funny because Roscard, um, <laughs> Roscard's fucking weird anyway, he's a drummer. He's a fucking drummer, he, drummers are all the same. He, uh, you know, he doesn't say much, he's like, oh, yeah, switch, you know, Joe will fucking talk to him. It was very uh, nerve-wracking for me to be the first one to go to start the uh, whole recording process. So you have to do the drums first before anybody else can do it. He owned that shit. You know, and like, he was all nervous and kind of tight and shit when he was setting up his drums because he was the first one to go and we weren't sure about the click track because back home, you know, fuck click track. You know, we just play it, you know? That's part of the feeling, right? You know, fuck click track. So. That's probably what made me the most nervous was uh, not having a lot of experience with the click track and I thought I was fucked. We played a few songs, you know, I had the click track on, the headphones and everything and the first couple songs, the first thing he says is, hey man, you're not too bad to click track at all. He made recording the drums look very simple uh, when really it's not, you know, recording to a, a click track for the first time. I mean, like, we screwed around with it in preparation to the studio, you know, maybe a couple of times before we went in there. And, like, he did really well with it. And I was uh, really stoked for him. It was just a lot of editing in the studio. Ben took care of a lot of stuff that was off in the click track. He just lined it all up. And Tempo changes were a fucking bitch. God, that's what fucked me right there. He's like, no, I'm just gonna have a change at that part. So just uh, make sure you, you hit the change at the right spot. I'm like, oh shit. That's not gonna be fun. Sweet. I just wanted to be in the room seeing him beat the fuck out of those things like he did, like he always does. He had that intensity of playing live, you know, it wasn't just going through the motions. Definitely what I remember the most about the drum tracks is uh, always being in the studio, you know, the recording booth with Roscar and like getting different angles with uh, video camera, di different stills, and uh, just like kind of going crazy with the, you know, the media.
I didn't feel any pressure being uh, videotaped because honestly, I was concentrating so hard on what the fuck I was doing, I didn't even know it was in there. Too many cameras in my fucking face. I got one over there, I got one over here. Uh, one of the biggest things I remember about drum tracks was Ben wanted to change the drums in Pandora. The whole Pandora thing, he wasn't liking what I was doing with the, uh, the drums. I guess I was doing too many fills over parts that Joe was singing. He had some ideas of his own, but it's really hard when uh, you're frustrated trying to, you know, record these songs that you've been playing for so long one way, and then you're actually relearning it in the studio right then and there. We've spent five years making these songs the way that we want them, and I went in there with the mentality that they were not, or you know, Ben was not going to change a single thing about one of our songs, and you know, there's no way that we know that, yeah, it, it could sound like a good idea at the time. It's different from what we've heard for the last five years, but six months from now we may say, you know what, I liked it better the other way, and you're stuck. You're stuck now because you recorded it the new way. Alright, hold on. I think some of those fills simplified a little more. When he said that, I knew some shit was about to get changed. I'm just saying, like, if I heard it like that, I would just think it was cluttered. I'd almost be more impressed if he was just yeah, like one crazy fill like that, I'd be like, wow, that dude's fucking Because then it's more smoking, like... Smoking, you yeah. know what I'm saying? Yeah. That's like what Josh Freeze would do or something, you yeah. know? I mean, even though it's like you're saying, like, Pantera, he'll play a lot of fills, but then... Can't you see? Yeah. It's a straight beat. Which gives it that... Right here. That's what makes you have your head just like... Because it, it lets the... There's breathing room for the guitar space. to be like... There's space. There's space. Yeah. That's what was missing, I think, but there wasn't enough space. Oh, Take it from the bridge. I'm sorry. All right. Yeah, it's a good time. You're going out of that. The last time I tried that. There we go. So it was kind of uh, kind of weird to have him sit down on my drums and start going off. I'm like, fuck, man. Maybe you should just record all the tracks for me. I don't, I don't know. I'll just show you the songs real quick. You go ahead and do your thing. I'll just sit back here. We'll just put my name on the CD. That'll be good enough for me. I was getting a little tired towards the end, yeah, I just wanted to lay down and take a load off. It's worn out, but I was still pumped the whole time. It was adrenaline rush. Being there, doing my thing, and then every day I went back to watch everybody else do theirs. It was a good experience. I loved it. Well, he finished uh, debunking all my shit. Still a drink. That word. <laughs>